Housekeeping? Who's there? Housekeeping, you want a towel? What kind of place is this? Alright, Dad, let me in. What are you doing in here? Ooh. Oh, you made these uh, yesterday, right? Yep. I wasn't here, so we'll get it. The next time we do <clears throat> eggs, we'll do it right from the beginning, so you guys will have like another really long video. But well, it's just the same as the chocolate buttercreams that yeah. I made. But we're gonna we're gonna do a whole other video. That's what the people want. That's where they're gonna get. You can see the eggs up here. But the molds. Okay. And you push it into the cornstarch. That's how you get the mold. Mm-hmm. And these have to be taken out gently. Gotta be gentle. Gotta be gentle. Otherwise, what will happen when they get bruised? They're soft. You know, they'll, they'll, they'll get crushed. This is a good shoulder workout. Holding this camera over here. Yeah. This is why it takes so long, though. You have to wipe off each, every single one. Yeah. They're very soft right now. Yeah. Because these are cream eggs. Mm-hmm. Lots of peanut butter. Yeah. Peanut butter cream eggs. Are these probably like one of the best sellers as far as the cream eggs go? Yep. Everybody loves the peanut butter eggs. And then what's the next best seller? Then I don't know. I don't know. How many, uh, how many eggs does it make in each mold? times four. That is a good question. So I think 12 times four is 48 plus two, so it's eight plus 48. So that'd be 40, no, nope, 52. Now that's some pretty quick math, huh? 52 eggs, though. Yeah, it's a good thing I'm not a math major. Yeah, me neither. For a science major, I was really bad at math and, like, really good at writing. But nobody really cares what you think about the Krebs cycle. You know? <laughs> they don't want your opinion on it. A nice B roll shot. See, some of these have flat spots on the bottom. Mm -hmm. See them? Mm. 
in the old days we used to put a, that was the bottom mm -hmm. and the round part was the top we put a little chocolate in there and we stick them together and we'd sell them like that huh. the chocolate covered with a little flour on top yeah but people don't want them anymore they just want it like that just uh chocolate covered yeah, that's, that's too much candy i think <laughs> yeah it is a lot of candy and we used to sell half pound eggs even bigger ones oh really no. like in the starch mold it was like the same kind of thing though Except for it was on a, a long a long piece of wood about this wide mm -hmm. with uh, four big eggs on it and then you would hand push it into the cornstarch mm -hmm. and pull it out gently so it would keep the shape. Mm -hmm. hmm. But we don't sell those anymore. Nobody wants them. It's too much, uh, too much cream to eat. Too much candy, I guess. Which, this is, that's fine with me because they were a real pain in the neck to make all the time anyway. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, they were tough. It's got some nice B-roll dad. This looks cool, right? It's nice and artsy. Yeah. Yeah. We're all about artsy, fancy stuff here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I think people know what this looks like. Let's go see what mom's doing. Dad'll be out in just a second. And... This time, I remembered to turn off the Wi-Fi extender, so I can go as close as I want to this thing, and it won't go, uh, it won't go nuts on me. So mom's making some chocolate carrots while she walks, watches Colleen Patrick Goudreau. True, 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 true. And my uh, security camera has gone completely on me. It's, on the fritz. It's gone sideways. <sighs> What's up with that? It's like panoramic or something. It's only like one camera though right yeah. now, isn't it? It's weird. Yeah, I'll have, to, I'll have to monkey with it. Yeah. Doing carrots and bunnies? Carrots and bunnies. <gasps> oh, I don't think people have seen this bunny yet. No, this is the rabbit on a basket, also mm -hmm. known as number 10. Now we have a plastic mold of this guy and we have a metal mold. Mm. In order to make them the oh, same... This looks like the metal one, is that right? I think I think it is. Uh, I'm gonna have to look at it very closely to see. Is it transparent never, never or can be too opaque? Sure. This sounds metal. Yeah. But in order to make the plastic one the same size as the metal one, I have to short pour that one a little bit. Because oh. for whatever reason, I'll put them side by side. For whatever reason, the metal one is a little bit bigger, but hmm. we do like them to weigh the same. So. Mm -hmm be consistent and stuff because mm -hmm. you you sell them as the same bunnies right they're not like different sizes or anything correct okay well that makes the sense i try to do that on occasion mm -hmm. i may not want people to expect it from me but yeah can you can show people the, the carrot mold what it looks like on the other sure. side am i allowed to you reveal may. our secrets uh no we don't make the little ones because they're pain in the neck huh. i don't like to do things that pain my neck now the way we wrap these bad boys. Okay, Mom, do the carrot mold. The way we wrap them is we do this part in green and this part in orange foil, and mm -hmm. it's uh, really neato. Really and neato. The sad thing is, because they're gonna ask. Uh huh. We don't ship them because they break. Oh, unless people want broken carrots. They want broken carrots. I mean, we, we'll wrap them in bubble pack. We've done it, but they very well may break. And if they do, I don't want to hear you crying in your chocolate. More carrots. Those are everyone's favorite carrots, chocolate carrots. Yeah, these are carrots your kids will eat, no problem. <laughs> Don't have to convince them I to eat it. Really. Yeah. There's Big Bad Dad. Long time no see, Dad. See. <laughs> Did you have to temper this chocolate, or is it already pretty? Pretty cool It'll since have it's been out. A few minutes, yeah. Yeah. But once I get, once it gets cool, then I just uh, add a, like a handful now and then, and then that way I can just keep going without stopping. Just keep her going. But the first bottle always takes a few minutes. Yeah. Hey, I figured out why my camera went kaplooey. Kaplooey? 
Mom, I wouldn't say that on camera. Oh, uh, wireless because we turned off, off the Wi-Fi. Uh -huh. The camera kind of went goodbye. And you went, what? What in the Sam Hill is going wow. on? So I talked watch. to my network administrator. That did, did you like look in the mirror and? No, I just looked. I, actually, my Kindle's fairly clean. I can see myself. Network administrator, what do you think it is? It's the wireless dummy. Oh, I didn't think of that. Mm, that sounds like three different voices. There's four different voices yeah. for two people. That's why we keep her down here. Yeah. <laughs> keep her down here. Don't want anybody to see her. Keep the public safe. Yeah. Because hmm. I'm like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Oh. So cliche in a candy store. Mm hmm. And that's where you drop the mic. Oh, yeah. Or the butter knife. <laughs> drop the butter knife moment. Um, look how artsy I am. Whoa. Whoa. Look at these cool shots. That's never been wow. done before. Now everybody's going to be doing so a crack. so cool. We're you the should, trendsetters. You should come up with a name for this technique. Oh, the... Through the... What are these? The through trays. the candy trays? Through the trays trick. Through the, uh, the old through the trays technique. <laughs> That's Triple T. Holy generation, Batman. Yeah. In, uh, in college, my friends had a joke that they called the triple threat. Mm -hmm. It's when you make your own joke... You or you set up the you set up the joke. You deliver the punchline, and you laugh before anybody else at your own joke. That's called the triple threat. Or a dork. Yeah. <laughs> deliver. The, say the joke. Deliver the punchline. Laugh. That's what Dad does a lot. Huh? He's called your dad a dork. What? It was dad jokes. Nothing. That's his job. He's got nothing to say. It's expected. <laughs> so that's his your day will come look and no respect <laughs> no respect he gets a lot of a lot of he has a lot of looks there's this other look <laughs> no respect <laughs> this look here that means I don't agree with what you're saying hey, say do it again I don't agree with what you're saying but I'm gonna let it go because I don't really feel like arguing right now <laughs> Show us, Steve. Show us. You can't that's even your, your Chucky. That's your Chucky. <laughs> the Chucky face. That's do not do Chuck, Chucky. What's his name on the on the Sports Center? Um, he always look. He, he always looks like that. Yeah. What's his name? <laughs> Chucky know. Chuckerson. No, I can't remember. Wait, do it. Do his face. Look at the camera and do his face. It's what he always looks like. He catches the ball. He runs with the ball. <laughs> that was a great impersonation. It's like he's here. Yeah. Wow. Got a real life celebrity here. Besides your dad? Mm, yeah. Besides dad yeah. and you. Oh, Mr. Celebrity? The light behind me, I think it's going. How can you tell? Because it's making funny noises. Really? It's like yeah. we're in a horror movie. So, if there's a celebrity handyman available at some point, I'd be swell if that bulb could get swapped out and replaced with a new one. Oh, also known as changing a bulb. Wow. How many candy makers Good does it take I had to change all a bulb? The instructions. <laughs> How many candy makers does it take to change one fluorescent light bulb? Hopefully the one. Hopefully the one. Yeah. Although, wait a minute. You know, he changed a bulb a couple weeks ago. In oh, yeah, we actually had that on video. In the shop? No, I no, no, not that one. It was a different bulb. Well, how many bulbs you changed? This was the in the bathroom where we live. He went up there, opened the lighting unit. Help me! <laughs> Help me! <laughs> he went up. And he got on the stool. He opened the lighting unit, and then he called me and asked for a bulb. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently, it takes two when we're in our house. Yeah. Down here, he handles all on his own. What do you have to yeah, say about that, you Dad? You did that. Yep, it was you. <laughs> That's his other look. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's the what, what's that look? That's the one that you were talking about earlier? Yes, the, that's the one. I'm just going to let it slide what you're saying because I don't feel like arguing. Happy wife, happy life. I'm pretty happy right now. <laughs> I'm me. crying a little bit. <laughs> Mom, are you crying again? Only a little. Tears in the chocolate? No. 
That could be like a, a Hallmark movie name. Tears in the Chocolate. Yeah. What would be the theme song? Tears in Heaven? <clears throat> mm. Yeah, Dad Clapton. could play it. Yeah. Dad has a great singing voice. We all do, really. Yep. Tears in Heaven. <laughs> The concert we went to last night, that was actually a sing-along. Oh, yeah? Yeah, it was loud enough so nobody could hear Kara and I singing, so it was fine. Oh, yeah, we, were, we mentioned in the video that I thought it was the one that you and I think Karen and Gail were going to. Yeah, that one that we're threatening to go to is Foreigner and Cheap Trick. Foreigner, okay. Foreigner and Cheap Trick. That's in July. Okay, that's what I was getting messed that, up that with. That one we're threatening to go to. Yeah. This you guys one, haven't bought tickets yet for that one? No. Okay. I think Gail's getting them. Yeah. But this one, because she just hovered up her truck for a tailgate. Wow. Yeah. I mean, we could have like chickpea dip, hummus, carrots, um, pane bread. Wow. Party, ah, your options are endless, really. Party down. Yeah. Water. Whoa. Yeah. Let's not get too crazy, Mom. Yeah. Uh, Juice. Juice. Yeah. Juice boxes. You think? Juice pouches. <laughs> Smoothies. Really, any kind of way to carry your juice. Yeah. Kara did thank me last night for um, not wearing a fanny pack. Because <laughs> I didn't want to carry a purse, but I just wore things that had lots of zippers. Oh, okay. They took our water at the gate. Oh. They took do, the water. Do you remember what uh, what Leah did at the pen relays when they tried to take her water? Yeah. Well, what, they took her water bottle, and it was a nice one. Yeah. And first, it should go let her have it, but then the, then the lady said... No, in fact, I'm just going to take it. And she took it. And I was like, hmm, nope. She took it back and ran. Yeah. So what are you going to do? <laughs> Catch me? <laughs> yeah. And the lady's yelling after her, people from Syracuse. S-U-C. <gasps> I'll just leave it at that. Yeah. Fill in that asterisk. Yeah. Asterisk. Um, yeah. yeah, and I think she you said something Leah like, I hope you lose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like something like that. You know why Leah did that? Because she does what she wants. You got it. <laughs> You know what I did when I went to the pen relays and I was racing and they, they were supposed to like look through your bags to make sure ever you don't have any water in there or anything? What, did you put, put it under your hat? Nope. I put my water bottle at the bottom and I put my underwear on top of it. Nice. Because they're not going to go through your underwear. Nice, nice, nice. So, I didn't even have to go through that. That sounds like a little trick that I pulled uh, in 4-H once. Yeah? It was like a 4-H forgery. Okay. I was in 4-H and every year we had to sew something, an outfit, and we got judged on the outfit and we got blue ribbons and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Well, I made this jacket. I was 12, I think. I made this jacket that zipped up. It was a really cool looking plaid jacket. And um, when I was snipping the threads, they're very, very particular that you snip the threads and all the seams be finished and whatnot. Well, when I snipped the threads on my final inspection, I made a little nick right here a little the little scissor tips made a v-shaped <gasps> hole i was like what do i do then i got some stitch witchery stuff and made, i put a patch on the back of it but they would always open it up and mm -hmm. look on the inside mm -hmm. so i didn't wear a shirt underneath mm. and i was like you're not gonna make a 12 year old go yeah <laughs> <laughs> well you were 12 years old and you thought of that yeah wow you're good <laughs> I'm, uh, maybe i've always been a little devious <laughs> <laughs> all right how much more time until you got to temper your i have to live with her <laughs> Mom, are you gonna cry now? No. <laughs> no. That sounds like a not. pretty hearty laugh, though. Hey, happy wife, happy life. I'm just trying to make him happy. We should start a GoFundMe for Dad to get him out of here. Okay, you're ready. <laughs> GoFundMe for Quick Steve. He needs a helicopter. He needs to get out of here ASAP. He needs, he needs enough food to survive the week. Make sure he changes the light bulb before he goes. <laughs> Dad's probably going to skip out of town before changing a light bulb. I hope not. I would never be able to figure that out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's a cool sound. Let's do that again over here. Okay. I can't make it again. I think you just did. Okay, you say so. I think everyone at home wants double boilers of chocolate. Yeah, hey, well, you know what? I gave him a link for where the double boilers are, and all you gotta do is get your chocolate. Yeah. And hot water, boom, done. Boom, done. Three ingredients. Three ingredients. I think we just did an ASMR video of this, too. But I'm probably gonna put that one up before this one. 
But if anybody wants to see just like 25 minutes of dad just covering these. With no sound. Yeah. It'll be up. Well, there's going to be sound, but it's just like there's, dad there's tapping. Like no funny. Yeah. There, you know, like, because like ASMR is, you know, for our viewers, obviously, we like ASMR. And it seems like a lot of people who don't watch ASMR videos, they like, they dislike them. They're like, wait, maybe, maybe you could do some more talking. It's like, well, that wouldn't work for ASMR. You just don't. Yeah. And people, like, people that. like that. Yeah. Okay. That is what we want. I mean, it's just, you know, relaxing to help them fall asleep too. Um, I forgot if we mentioned it before, but dad's always like, I don't get this. Like why we can't talk for a half an hour while we, uh, when we make these. And then, um, dad falls asleep to the fireplace channel on <laughs> Amazon fire. And, and we're like, dad, that's the same thing. And you're like, what? Well, that's different. <laughs> Cause it's like a crackling fire. That's different. No. Yeah. Oh, say that again. Show him your face. That's his, that's different face. Go ahead. That's different. Uh, you toned it down a little bit. Well, I can only do a replay. Yeah. <laughs> you can do it about six in a row. That's yeah. different. That's different. That's different. Oh, I just did right now. Oh, I didn't even have to edit noises. it. <laughs> mm, what's that? What's that grumble mean? Um, that kind of often goes with the face, but I don't know if you can do them both at the same time, so they just kind of come separately. <laughs> What time are you guys leaving? Uh, it's not time for lunch yet. Plus, we still have to watch the news. Mm -hmm. See what's happened in the last mm -hmm. minutes. Mm -hmm. I imagine there's been some weather mm -hmm. happening. <laughs> All right. Well, I should I should put this down because we haven't done a Snapchat story yet today. So let's let's go do that. Snap our chat. Sounds like fun. That's why we're here. <laughs>